In today's video, I am doing a minimalist nail care collection. I thought I wanted to show you guys the items that I would typically use to do my nails. Let's get right into the video. Here is my nail bag. This is what I hold all of my nail care items in. This went from being a pencil pouch to a makeup bag to now my nail care holder. Um, I got this from a thrift store many years ago and now this just hold all of the nail care items that I own very well so yeah that's the bag that i use to hold my items this here is my obviously you can see my nail polish remover this used to be a clear um jewelry cleaner but we have that bottle for so many years i decided to just throw out the liquid inside of it rinse it out and put my nail polish remover in it that way it's just more easier and convenient for me whenever i need it to use it it can just squirt out inside of a pad i can just quickly use it clean my nails and boom it's done so everything fits inside of that bottle here next is my Broadway mini manicure that I bought from the dollar store. Um, I do think I might eventually get rid of that as well because I don't use it as much. I do use that critical cleaner right there more than I even use the clippers because I have a drill and I hardly ever use those scissors. So I think that might be the next thing that I might get rid of in my collection and I just might keep my nail critical cutter that's the only thing I might keep and just get rid of those two items all together also you may notice that the lighting is changing in the video I just noticed this when I was editing it and doing a voiceover I'm not sure as to why it's doing that but it is sorry here is my rusty dusty basic nail filer I think everyone should own this instead of a nail clipper it easily fouls and take all the snags that's on your nails way easier next up is this new product that i bought from amazon um this is the beatles nail polish i will link down and link below um the link that i bought it from amazon um but this is what i bought this is gel nail polish only in the color black and white um, the white is in color 894 and the black is in 895. This came together in a set. I only bought the two. I'm very picky on the colors that I wear on my fingers and on my feet, practically on my fingers and my feet. I only wear red, white, um, clear nail polish, or even nude, but that's about it. I don't like to wear any other colors that brings too much attention to my feet or my nails and also I also wear white of course but those are the only colors that I wear here is my nail treatment Kyoko oil um, whenever I use the nail polish remover because the chemicals are so harsh I always put this on my nails after I use it and after I do my gel nail here is my clear LA Color Gel Nail Polish. This is the first nail polish I got before I got the other two white and black gel nail. Um, this is what I have on my nails right now in the video. Um, but yeah, that's what I owned. Oh yeah, also I do owe some brush on kiss nail glue. You might be thinking as to why do I have that, but that's like my secret to why my nails last so long and why my nails grow so long obviously not in this video i cut my nails but usually this is the secret as to why my nails grow so long if you want a video on how i do my nails and how i grow them out then let me know in the comments down below this is one of my most favorite thing my so happy that i invested in this but this is my own personal nail gel drill sorry um i bought this from amazon i think it was nine dollars i'll make sure i link this down be comics box below as well as too but this works so well i remember i first seen this at the nail salon I'm like, oh my gosh i need this for myself um so this is basically what i use whenever i used to get my nails done i would always draw them on my home um it came with a plug the well, plug is not that long it's really short so you have to be really near when they drill the nails but it's amazing um that's what i use to like cut my nails or file or shape my nails instead of using a nail clipper here is one of my other favorite items that I bought myself. Here's my Hermonist nail dryer. I remember when I first got gel nail done at the salon, I remember I seen this and I was like, okay, I need to get myself this as well. 
um, whenever you use gel nail polish it does not dry by air well you're gonna have to get this if you do gel nail but I only put my hand under the dryer for at least 60 um, seconds or at least 10 to 5 seconds it does um, light up it does come apart as well and it does come with its own plug the plug is a bit long as you can see that's the print is where you put your fingers if you don't want to use the base you can use that that's what it looks like on the inside um, but I kind of wish I plugged it in so you can see what it looks like this I can't remember how much it would cost but of course yes I'll link down below you can use this for both your feet and also for your hand if you own your own nail business or if you're a nail technician you can buy this and use that as well so that is just amazing I kind of wish it came smaller but that's the only bigger size that they had this is the reason why I'm switching out my nail bag because of this big old thing so I want to find a bag that will fit this and hold all of my nail items together um, that was just the speed limit that they have, the speed time that they had on there that I'm showing you. And that is what it looks like. So that is all the items that I use for my minimalist nail collection. Um, let me know in the comments down below what you think of my collection. And um, just don't forget to like and subscribe if you would like to to see more of my content more minimalist collection that i own and stuff that i have as a minimalist and yeah so thanks for watching and bye